Hi, this is Emanuela Giudice for Le Bijou and Discret, this week about big and yes is more. Around the name of B.R. Kingles in the 2006, has born the working group which decides to recollect the projects done in the period of 10 years. First of all, with the Rovin exhibition set up for the Architecture Center of Copenhagen, then with these Archie comics published by Taschen about the evolution of architecture. What have in common Miss Van der Rohe, Robert Venturi, Philip Johnson, Ren Kulas, Barack Obama and B. R. Kingles? The word more, that beside that exclamation yes, defined the manifesto of the Danish group for their utopic pragmatism. From the Miss Van der Rohe's Less is More to the Roper Venturi's Less is Bore is a short step to compromise represented by the close-up of Philip Johnson and by the comics which refers to that. To the architect Renkulas Ingels, member of the studio OMA in Rotterdam, recognizes the awareness of a projectual action presided by the comprehension of the reality. Barack Obama, too, finds a place in the big architect's book. His Yes, We Can become the exclamation which searched the change men through a democratic sub-movement. So, Yes is More, in the big white balloon, represents how to operate with a new topic pragmatic architecture, which has the purpose to create perfect place in a social, economic and environmental way. There are many projects in the book, from the Danish stand in the Shanghai Expo to the VM House of Copenhagen. Using the comics, Ingers tries to represent the possibility to live in the space of these architectures. It's like a video on the paper, The photography is the medium to find the details of the plastics, the digital scenarios giving the possibility to understand the utopic pragmatism of Big. The main part of Big's work is about architectural and urban projects. Ingels explains that his idea follows the replacement of the master plan by the masterpiece, an instrument which makes start folks about what the city should be about what we want from the neighborhoods where we live. At the end, Big's attitude is that one to consider all the needs from who participate in the project. The architecture searches the solution of compromise, takes the distance from the politics, but considers the problems and tries to solve them. The utopic pragmatism of Big isn't afraid of the confrontation. In fact, it accepts to regain the yes we can. Finally, everybody can participate to the architecture. Everyone can give their own contribution, democratic.